Hey everyone, welcome back. I am here to do another copper drop video with my brother Derek. I got a lot of great feedback from it last time. This time we are gonna do a back to school edition. Absolute mission is for Derek to find a one pair of shoes that he would cop because he's so picky and so cheap. What are you doing? Oh no, what are you doing? Whenever you run away like a little girl like that, I get scared. Sorry. What are you doing? I need a bandana on. I have a copper drop without that drop top. On the hat, hat. I had that bandana on today. And there's fing makeup all over it. Thanks for ruining it. This is a Gucci Louis Vuitton Supreme collab. You know how much it cost me? This is not like so. Two bucks. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> can we just get this over with so I can stop looking at ugly ass shoes for the next 20 minutes? I was just explaining that my mission is to find a pair of shoes that you will cop. Why are kids watching it back? You know what? I have kind of back to school shoes that I got? Airwalk. You know what the hell that is? Walmart. So you, need to, yeah, you need to move over. This video is mine or yours. Get 20,000 subscribers because you're special now. Oh, why are we doing this because you think it's gonna get a lot of views like the last one? You know what's crazy? Everyone says I'm the mean one when you're way meaner. Yeah, in the videos, but in real life, who's. Oh my oh, god. Oh, in real oh, life. Yeah, real life. Hey. Alright, shoe number one. Shoe is gonna look like a fucking piece of garbage. It is not gonna look like oh a piece god. of garbage. I have a headache. You don't have to the rest by yourself and enjoy getting zero views without my amazing intellectual stimulation about shoes. Goodbye. Yeah, that's right. You can't even see me anymore. John Cena in this. Ew! Don't! I almost cracked the glass with my fat ass. Okay, so these are. Draw! I more so wanted to ask you what you thought about these shoes in terms of what shoes do these remind you of? Yeezys. These are the Puma ripoff of the new Yeezys. See, I'm not dumb. Okay. Well, what did you expect this to Airwalk Walmart edition? No, I, I know something about shoes. Okay, so these are the Puma Thunder Desert. They come out August 9th for $130. Um, I think they've already released some because they've seen them on Foot Locker. I like them more than the actual Yeezy ones. They're less chunky. I, I hated the Yeezy ones, but then I saw like people wearing them and I think like if you can raw, if you have confidence and you can wear them, like they look really cool. They I, do. I, I, can, I can't wear them. Like I can never wear them, but some people can. Do you feel the same way about these then? No, because there's no color. Picture of the Yeezys. I know what they look like. They're like they have like like an orange dot on them and stuff. Oh no, they have Yeezys that look exactly like this. I, I don't. I don't like the light colored ones. And those, just, again, just In the look. last video, you said you only like plain colored shoes but that not. aren't white. Exactly. This is dirty white. What did I say the last time? Did you not watch your own goddamn video? Hey, it's a green version of them. Okay, well you need to say cough or drop before you move on to the next shoe. I'm just a fucking hater. No, I'm not a hater. You mean you're asking my opinion and you say you're gonna cut it out? <laughs> you can't just cut out my opinion, you fucking asshole. It was even worse. It's the poop green. Okay, come on. You think those are nice? Poop green? It's leaf green. Yeah, that's like mint. That's like mint. Yeah, that's pastel green. They're both disgusting. You're disgusting. Hey, why, what, what do you like about them? I like them because they're like those Yeezys. I know a lot of girls are going crazy for these shoes and buying them already. If I'm somebody who doesn't know shoes and I only know like there's a Yeezy that looks like, I'm gonna think you're wearing Yeezys. And then the second I figure out they're not, I'm like, you're a fucking loser. Why? Because you judge people based on the brands that no, they wear? it's like, it's- Two dollars. Don't bandana. touch my bandana! What? I got a gold chain. Where's yours? Bought you that. You did not. My mom bought me this. I contributed to the pot of that. Oh, really? Yeah. I would cop these shoes 100%. I don't have the money right now, so I wouldn't buy them. I think you said that about every single shoe last time. <laughs> I don't really want to cop these. I never will, but... <laughs> I mean, I have rich rich as fuck like me and be a millionaire. You know what? One thing I can say is I bought the Rihanna Fenty Puma Creeper. That's not the name. You know what? I'm going to get them right now. Well, guys, I'm going to tell you right now, looking at these green, poopy, disgusting, the green ones or the beige ones, I would not buy because who is it for? $160. You know what else I could spend $160? Oh, these were a bit of Shut the f up. These were a bit of an impulse. You got those in Value Village. They were $180. Oh my. <laughs> Plus tax. Rihanna, I am broke because of you. I saw them on her and they look so good. I've worn them twice. Ever. So, look at the bottom of these shoes. So hold on, hold on. We go, we film a video for your channel where we go and I have to get my nose pierced and you make me pay for it. But you will be, you didn't make me! You didn't make me. In the car, you're like, I'm like, okay, let's not do it. You're like, no, you're gonna take it. Is this a copper drop? Drop! Cop. Don't, why are you clicking on these shoes? <laughs> these are do high! You, do you, these shoes are high! Do you click these just knowing that Derek's not gonna like them? No. What the f is that? Oh. Jesus Christ! So these are Air Force Ones. Obviously, they're special t-shirts. Obviously, they're Air Force Ones. They say Uptown on the back of them. They come out for $140 on August 9th. To them, not me, Mila. I'm the last person that wants to hear these. I'm educating you! I don't want to be, I don't want to be here! Then go, I'll do it alone. Okay, fine, I'll do it. Don't put the sympathy card. These are 
the Nike Women's Air Force One Low Upstep Uptown Black, and then they have them in red as well. Nike is paying homage to the roots of the Air Force One with the gold oh, roots. This is a collab with roots. Wow, Canada's getting on the sneaker. Feminine tradition. No, it's from roots, the brand. Okay. It's fine. I oh think. no, this is the Bruno Mars Uptown Funk shoe. Yes. Is it actually? <laughs> so the real cool thing about these shoes is that this is actually an arrow, as you can see. I didn't even see that! What? I thought it was just an all black shoe. The only thing I like about these shoes is the camo at the bottom. I think that's the dumbest thing. I'm not even just saying that to you. I feel like that looks so like not like it's not supposed to be there. Like they started making a shoe and have like, you know what? Camel's not in anymore. Let's make it. No, the camel makes it awesome. I would drop these shoes just because when I first look at them, I'm like, whoa, I would look like I have craters on my feet. And if you have like ugly ankles, it's literally just pointing to your ankle. Like, look how ugly and ashy my ankles are. But I would drop. Every time I look while you're scrolling through, I just on Nike. I want to pick some that I haven't looked at either. These are the Nike Kyrie 4 kicks. Let me preface this. These are a basketball shoe. What the f is this Fred Flintstone looking ass shoe? What is this? <laughs> what is this? No, don't hate on this. So the Nike Kyrie 4 Kicks features an Amarillo mesh upper with a Kicks logo placed on the left tongue. Additional details, bright blue on the swoosh and midsole, graphic insole, kick cereal on it, and it's white cereal rubber shoe. Also. That's a cereal brand. Oh, really? Is it American? Yeah. Oh! They retail for 120 bucks. They drop on August 11th. If I was a ball player, which I only play for fun, I would 100% cop these shoes. Yellow is one of my top three favorite colors. Blue is my favorite color. Oh, so this is the inside. Yeah. Oh, like, it's like a bowl of cereal with a little smell. You would wear these. No, I would fucking not. <laughs> what? Why did you say that as if you knew I was going to say yes? Say yes. <laughs> these look so stupid. Come on. Yo, you make this process so beautiful. Okay, if I, when you're playing basketball, you kind of want to be Sneaky, everybody just stand like a sore thumb on the court. When you're a good basketball player, you want people to look at you, you want people to oh. see your fly ass shoes. These are Kyrie's. Who is that? Kyrie Evans? Is that right? Holy Irving. Or er, Kyrie Irving! Is farting allowed in your videos? No. What happens if I do? Will I get kicked out? Yeah. Well, no, no, don't fart. Ah! These are the Nike Air Max One Premium Reds. Okay. They come out for 130 bucks on August 11th. I would buy these shoes. 130 bucks. I mean, for you guys, f***ing nickels and dimes, you wipe your ass. Oh my God, no, I don't. I saved my money, okay? It's not my fault. Why are you shaming uh, me? I saw the money on your nightstand nice today. What, my 100 American dollars? Yeah, I found that. So you just wipe my ass. Poor little piece of shit. <laughs> How do you feel about these shoes? I think they're actually, I mean, they look pretty decently cool. The thing about me is though, I don't like super all black shoes. If this is a copper drop, they're nice, but I'm not gonna buy them, okay? Don't fucking yell at me. This is my opinion. If I saw those at the store, I would not want to buy them. They look nice, they're very nice. I would not buy them though. Dropped. Don't punch me. I'm just giving my honest opinion. Just moving on. Piece of shit. Hard to make smart jokes around stupid people. Well, I'll keep that in the video. Yeah, but you're gonna edit out every single time you punch me in the side of the head. I haven't even punched you. Oh, yeah, because you edited it out, Mila. Ew, what are these? Ew, here's somewhere we're gonna agree. Jordan, what the hell? Air Jordan 11 Low Yo, I. Sick! Yo! These are hideous. They come out on August 16th. Is that a basketball Don't shoe? buy them. They're Jordan. They're Jordan 11s, which I normally really like. Volt green with cement gray. In what world is that a good idea? Holy shit, these are hideous. $170 US, August 16th. August 16th. <laughs> Can't believe that. They know that's an important date. Drop. Yeah. Peace out. Okay, this is something I really want to talk about. Because, this is human race? Yes. So, Pharrell and Adidas, NMD, Who, Trail, Solar Pack, IRS, Aqua. Holy shit, that's a lot to say. They retail for 250 US, okay? These are expensive ass shoes. August 18th. But all of these Pharrell shoes, I just don't understand. They're so popular. I don't get it. Because it's hype. Super famous people always wear them. Well, the only thing I've ever seen that's cool is like people like mix and match the shoes. Like wear one of each? Yeah. And you like that? No, that's why people think it's cool. Okay, y'all. I like the color of the shoes. It's just I don't understand how people break their backs over these. So do you like them? No. I would drop these two. Honestly, like 250 bucks. Hold. The normal. I can't wear a bright ass color on my foot. I think they look cool, but I can never wear them. I think I could wear them. But I do like the idea of mixing and matching. I think having shoes that are like different colors, but they're all the same except different colors, so you can wear two different ones is kind of cool. So like if I wore a, two pairs of Jordans that were like. No, that's stupid. <laughs> <laughs> just so I know you have a picture of you wearing two 
I know. Yeah. <laughs> if I had the money, I would cop these shoes because I'm so pretentious that I like to wear them around well, what? with a great tracksuit and be like, bam, look at her shoes from far away. What would you even wear these with, though? All gray, all black, all white. You're, you're so limited to what you freaking wear. Because I wear so many bright colored shoes, a lot of my wardrobe is neutral colors. So, for this. so I bought this. It's from h and Yeah, so I bought this from a thrift store and I was like, oh, it looks kind of easy, like, like I like it. So I just bought it because it's $5. And it says here, tell, tell me something. something new, but on here it goes, same old story, bro. Oh my God, you're a I love this sweater so much, but I just hate that it says bro right here, but I still wear it because I love the color. H&M will literally put any saying on their shirt. Yeah, it's like taco. Vicinity, gone strange or something. And like literally you can say any function of words and throw it on a shirt and H&M will sell it. Those are pretty nice. Oh, that color. Stop. Okay, I recant my statement. I am going to try to cop this colorway of these Pharrell shoes. Holy shit, the pink, the green. What do you mean color? Yes. How is this a colorway? Somebody vomited a box of crayons onto a shoe. It's literally every color. And it says mother. And I love my mama. These are the Adidas NMD R1 brands. I don't care how much money I have. I'm going to try to get them. I don't understand. Are you going to punch me? Are you going to punch me if I speak my mind? No. Look at me. I'm <laughs> like holding my arms. <laughs> it's <with this>. like, <laughs> I feel like I've seen this shoe 50 different times from 50 different companies. So why is this one so important? I particularly like this shoe because normally I don't like NMDs, how like the whole white part of the shoe on the outline sticks out so much, but I love how these breads combine the colors and then the shoe looks so like classy. I could wear these with almost anything. That's true. Like they don't look chunky. But I love the color scheme. I love all bread color schemes. They come out on September 6th for $130. US 1200 wants on on kicks on fire so usually people say if they want the shoe and the more they want the more hype they are or harder to get so oh. I assume these shoes will be sold out dude you gotta learn how to do uh, sneaker bots so I can uh, yes I yes I have to learn yeah I have to learn you're a smart technological yeah learner. I'm like the social I'm the, so what are you I'm the good looking one oh. <laughs> Yeah, freaking right. Or you even look at these shoes. Do you know who Carmelo Anthony is? Oh uh, yeah, best baseball player there ever was. Almost beat Babe Ruth. Just kidding, he's a basketball player. I'm not that stupid. They're the Air Jordan 13 Carmelo Anthony class of 2002s. They're your favorite <laughs> shoes. Why am I here? Just shut up because you're going to say you hate them anyways. These shoes come out on September 15th for $190 Holy dick. US. Yeah, they're really expensive. Black and yellow shoes. I'm a sucker for those. I will not be copying these shoes. There's too many releases coming out. For, for those of you who like Air Jordan 13s, these are the ones to get ASAP. My turn? Just go. Why? Why are you so sad about me speaking my opinion? Okay. Guys, as you can tell, these are very hype shoe. There's almost 6,000 wants. So there's almost 6,000 fucking idiots on this planet <laughs> that would pay $190 for this shoe. Black with university gold. I think that looks pretty cool. It's just, I think the shoe looks, I don't like the way the shoe looks. No, bad. No bueno. There's no bueno. We are going to be on the same page about these shoes. These are the ugliest shoes that I've seen releasing. I don't care what hate I get online for these shoes. These are... <laughs> yeah, yo. First of all, okay, so these are the Air Jordan 18 yellow suede. They look like you're wearing mustard turds on your feet. It looks like a hot pocket. There's a little like section there, the cheese and all the pepperonis in there. I am dropping these shoes. I'm surprised they even got to 300 wants. It's different. I mean, you, you can't say it's not different. You can't miss them coming from 50,000 uh, yeah. miles and if, away. And if you're a person who likes to stand out and you like obscure things, like Lady Gaga wore a dress of meat, okay? I think somebody would be willing to wear these shoes. Oh, the great fives. No, no, they're close. These are the Air Jordan 5 Energy Fresh Prints. Couple things to say about these shoes. Good guess on the colorway. It is the great colorway. The same ones that the raccoon stole of mine that I destroyed. Now, what is missing on the shoe? Laces? That is purposely done. Really? Do you know why? Because the Fresh Prince doesn't wear laces. Is that right? Yeah! Oh shit! Yeah! So, Will was notorious for wearing shoes without laces. Oh, I didn't see that. That's sick. The insoles. I would never cop these shoes because the lack of laces is just too weird for me. I would maybe buy them if I was rich to be like, oh, I got the Fresh Prince shoes. I honestly don't. I think that's super cool. That little like Easter egg of how he doesn't wear it in the show. So you're, when you get them, you're not going to get them either. That's fucking dope. I, I think it's cool. I wouldn't buy them because I don't watch the show. If I watched the show, I would buy them. Other details on the shoe include the West Philadelphia text underneath the tongue. So they say West Philadelphia uh, underneath. Can you put laces in there? 
No. What do you mean no? Yeah, there's no holes to put the laces oh, in. They're actually filled. That's even cooler. They're like, bitch, if you buy these, you're not wearing them with laces. Yeah, see, what really gives the shoe the Fresh Prince vibes is the decision to remove the customary lacing system by sealing the lace holes, resulting in a slip-on design, much like Will used to wear on your favorite 90s sitcom. Special mention to these shoes, I think that's awesome. I'm gonna drop them, retailing for $1.90 on September 25th. All you hardcore Will Smith fans or Fresh Prince fans should get out there and get these shoes. Hey, we agreed on something. Don't touch me, please. Want some Fenty on your face? Get the fuck off me, Neon. Man, if I had all the money in the world, I would just sit online and buy shoes all day. Yeah, I'm a terrible person, guys. Neon has all the money in the world. She's gonna buy shoes all day. I would probably try my best to help other people in need. Oh, how much do you donate, everyone? How much do you donate? I actually donate $40 a month. Wow. I donate 41, idiot. Donate to myself. So these are the Air Jordan 12 Bulls. Obviously, they are paying homage to the Chicago Bulls. There's lots of wants for these shoes. There's 24,000 wants. These are a big shoe. Air Jordan 12s. I love this shoe. They're a little bright for my liking even. Like bright red shoes are so noticeable and you yeah. can't really wear anything else with them than plain colors. These come out on November 23rd. These shoes this far in advance. They're telling you like you got four months to wait for these shoes? Yeah, people get ready. While there are no early looks with the sneaker yet, the Air Jordan 12 Bulls colorway is listed as gym red, gym black. This means that the shoe to be dominated by the red color. So what that means is the picture up on the screen is just a visually created photo. I'm a guess of what the shoe is gonna look like. People oh. do that a lot for really hype shoes that are in release. I would not cop these shoes. Uh, too bright, November 23rd, 190 US. Lots of money, graceful. I hope they drop for a little bit less, then maybe I'll get them. I feel like even looking at the retail price is just so unrealistic. Huh. No one's gonna get it for that price. Only sneaker heads. Don't click on those. Why are you clicking? So these are the Air Jordan 5 satin breads. Again, lots of breads coming out this Oh, this is so ugly. This shoe releases November 26th for 190 US. I actually don't like these shoes. They're super hype. I don't like them. I think a lot of people will buy these shoes. That's never been done before. You take a picture with flash on and it lights up. That's almost every single fucking shoe nowadays. Cool thing about these shoes is that in the dark, only the tongue lights up as white. That's cool. I don't like the shine. November 26th, drop, sorry. You guys all know my answer. Do I even need to say it anymore? You know what, next time, do this with Jazz Ball. How about that? Fine. I will do it with wow, Jazz Ball. Wow, that easy? Yeah. These are the Air Jordan 11 Concords. These are the Jordan Classic, okay? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> wow, hold! The Concords, I heard about those. So, Jordan Brand is already prepping his holiday 2018 lineup and it's gonna bring back the Air Jordan 11 Concords. There's 38,500 likes for this shoe. December 8th. Yeah. People waiting around like this is the next iPhone. <laughs> That's so messed. People like shoes that yeah, much. These, eh? these are retailing for more. So these are retailing for 220 US when normally it's like 190 US for a high pair of J's. Uh, December 8th, just like he bitched about. White, black, dark concords. I will 100% try to cop these shoes. I haven't said that this whole video. <laughs> I, know, I, know. I, I was like, why are you laughing? I fucking haven't said it for everything for once. Jordan is using the same design that they used from 1995, which is awesome. I like the OG Jordan. I was born in that year. Did you yeah. cop them? No. Would you wear them if I bought them for you? Well, I, will, I mean, I'll wear anything you buy from you. You prefer like a plain ass I pair of Stan like, Smith? No. Oh, my jazz ball? You know what? I think it's important to note, even though we're looking at all these hype shoes that are coming out, Derek and I both wear bands and plain shoes just as much as the next person. That's all I wear. Okay, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I rock those shoes all the time. You can't get these shoes, don't hate on yourself. We couldn't get these shoes until we were adults. And really, it doesn't even matter. Even if you're wearing fucking airwalks, like it doesn't matter. If you, if you rock them, if you rock them, you can rock them. If you have confidence, it doesn't matter. If I saw a guy walk around those are nice airwalks, like, yeah, they're fucking sick, I'd be like, yeah, they are. What if you're a kid and you get, if you're a kid, a lot of people watch this video, probably kids in high school who get made fun of for an average choice. You have air walks? Yeah. You air walk all over those bullies. You take the shoe off and just beat the shit out of them with it. From some sources on Instagram, this is not 100% conform. This is, <laughs> Not 100% confirmed, but the Air Jordan 6 Tinker. Like Tinkerbell? So the sketch above has been created once again to give us a look of what it might look like. I love these shoes. I love Air Jordan 6s. I really like the blue and gray. Do you feel that these are not too colorful, but not too plain? But not too white, but not too black? These are the top, these ones are here? Yeah. They're not ugly. If I saw somebody else, I'm like, oh, those are kind of cool. Okay, these come out October 6, 2018. They come out October 6, 2018 for $190. Don't buy them unless you're an idiot. I'm gonna try to 
cop these. Oh, unless you have a lot of money, then go ahead and buy them. Yeah. Let's go look at some Gucci shoes. Cover drop Gucci edition. So everyone, wait, it's my hair first. Today is another sad day where Derek rejected every shoe because he has terrible taste, but it's okay. I hope Don't you like some taste. of these shoes that I'm gonna try to get before the new year. Derek, have fun wearing your Vans, that's cool. If you don't like any of those shoes, that's cool too. I mean, wear your Vans every day, but for you hype beasts out there, tune in if you wanna see some more Copper Drop videos. Next time we are gonna do a designer edition of this. Oh yeah, something Mila can't afford and I can relate to because I'm rich as f You have one Gucci thing and everything else you own is under $50. How many Gucci things do you own, Mila? Derek, who's oh. a materialistic. Oh, okay, so. materialistic, Mrs. Jordan, Jordan. Oh my God, Jordan, I'll buy anything, Jordan. I won't buy anything, Jordan. You would if you could. You would if you could. Thank you, everyone, for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode of our Copper Drop. Derek is the most stubborn ass ever to exist, but I bet some of you like these shoes. So next time, designer edition. Have a great night, and thank you for watching my channel. Have a great night. <laughs>